there, this is Jess from Metabase. Today we are looking at the differences between Metabase versus Sisense. So if you're looking for a solution for embedded analytics, you've come to the right place for a slightly opinionated take. Um, of course there are no right or wrong answers, it will depend a lot on what your specific use case is, your budget, how much technical resources you have to get going, and what kind of timeline you're looking at to get to proof of concept. Um, but this is mostly based on stuff that we've heard from customers who have tried both SciSense and Metabase and now choose Metabase for their embedded analytics. So the first thing you need to know, Metabase is open source and pretty affordable compared to most of the alternatives, including SciSense. Um, so we've heard from one customer who has switched recently that they're saving tens of thousands of dollars by using Metabase for their embedded analytics compared to SciSense. The other thing to know is that you can get up and running with Metabase pretty quickly and get to a proof of concept pretty fast for your embedded analytics. So again, we've heard from another customer that they were able to get to their proof of concept within a couple of weeks within the free trial period. Um, similar reports for SciSense kind of put that timeline at about six months um, and you do need to be working with their sales team to sort of sort out your contract and um, get it going for you. With Metabase, you can start a free trial you don't even need to talk to us if you don't want to, but you can if you want. Um, so if you're looking to embed your analytics, you probably want a good idea of what it looks like. Um, so here we are in the Metabase um, embedding demo, which is on our website. Um, but let's also take a quick look at what you can do with SciSense's version. Um, so they have an embedding SDK. So if you're a developer, you can get more of a sense of uh, what the code looks like. Let's view that. You can copy it to your clipboard or just run it in this frame as well. Um, so here you get really a feel for what this would look like in your app. You can see they've got some hovers and things. You can click around to change the data. You can also try out their customization options. Um, so if you wanted to apply a different color set for your brand, you could do that. Ooh, bright green. Okay, maybe uh, get a designer to help you out with that. Um, of course, this is all just kind of point and click. Pretty cool. Uh, but heading back to Metabase's embedding demo. So this is just on our website. Again, uh, you can find this on our embedding page um, and I'll drop the link here. Um, this is kind of skips that developer step. So this is really what it will look like in your app. You can see that it's been customized to look like Edumation. They've got their logo, their name, fonts, colors, branding here. Um, and all the good things about Metabase embedded into their app. So things like breakouts, you can kind of pull threads, discover more. Let's see which uh, student actually did the best in that semester. Okay, we can see Bob Gaza. So that's some cool things with breakouts which are already set up for you. Metabase kind of gets the feel for the data and um, sets up your breakouts for you. You can also have different tabs and your customers can click around, filter different tables based on what's most important to them. Say I wanna find out some more data on just on, on the homework assignments that I set, I can do that. You can also embed the entire query builder. So if your users need to run their own queries or ask questions without needing to know SQL or come to your data team to run their reports for them, they can ask a question here. So let's say I want to find out where my students are based. We can just run a quick question in the query builder here. And there we go, I can see where my students are coming from. Um, another thing to know about Metabase Embedded Analytics is it's multi-tenant, so you can give permissions to different user groups based on the data that they need to see and nothing else. So here we're looking at, um, at Anna's profile. We can only see her uh, courses and students. So if we switch to Mary, let's just go back to that overview. Now I'm seeing only Mary's courses and I'll only be able to see Mary's students as well. So I'm not seeing any kind of, any data that 
is not relevant to me as Mary. So again, that is just kind of a quick idea of what embedding with Metabase versus Sciafence looks like. Um, you can start a free trial with Metabase and play around with it and see how, how you'd use it. Something else to know about Metabase is it's trusted by over 50,000 companies for their analytics. So from startups all the way through to enterprise level customers like Comcast, Zalando, um, Holland and Barrett, plenty more. Check out our website for all the details. Um, again, start a free trial. Let us know what you think. See how far you can get with your embedded analytics.